The reason hamburgers are so cheap at fast food restaurants is because they're paid for with your tax dollars. If meat was not subsidized, its value, its cost would go way up. You know, there's a reason you can buy a stack of hamburger patties for the same price as maybe two organic tomatoes at the store. In spite of the fact that those organic, or not organic, those hamburger patties, you know, if you looked at the requirement to make that from feeding the animal, you know, providing water for the animal, if you saw all the stuff that went into producing those hamburgers, it would be an enormous cost of water and food and materials and labor and time compared to what it took to grow those two organic tomatoes. The only reason they're the same price at the store is because your government is subsidizing those hamburger patties. They're not subsidizing organic tomatoes. Think about it. Why do they want you eating hamburgers and not stuff that's actually good for you? Because we live in this big machine that uses and abuses us. They want you to get sick. They want to get you on their pharmaceuticals. They want you to pay for their expensive hospitals. And understand, all of this is because we're in the system, you know? If we lived in a world where we took our most intelligent 12-year-olds and we said, okay, you know you want to be a doctor? We're going to get you on the path right now to being a doctor. You're going to be in school from the time you're 12 to 22. You're going to be studying. You're going to be learning. You're going to be studying with older doctors. By the time you're 22, you're going to be a world-class doctor. We could do that with our society. It wouldn't even be expensive. And if we had a bunch more doctors, guess what? Healthcare would drop way down. But instead we live in this world where healthcare has a price on it and doctors get rich. You know? Because it's not really about health. It's about controlling people, exploiting them, making money off them. Sending the lion to jump through the wheel of fire. So anyway, I'm just talking about shit. But this is the state of affairs. We're living in a nation where we're losing our rights. You know, we're being scared on purpose. We're being turned against each other. The truth's being demonized. And it's all because not enough people are speaking up. That's why I've given up the last five years to speak out. Because I'm the lion in the cage who realizes it's just one lion. I can't do enough. I need this lion to come back me up. And all the other ones not in the picture. You know? Thing is, if I claw this guy and run out the cage, you know, they're going to call all the other lion keepers. I'm going to end up being the next deadline. You know what I mean? But if all the lions rebel, different story. You know what I mean? All right, truth seeker. Until next time.